I think if anybody else was in there, they wouldn't have survived, y'all. Lord just had a pocket, a, a, a pocket just for her to sit in. That whole car was too that little section of the car that I sat in was the only section. If you look at the car, 
the way the side is banging in, the way the back, the only part that I guess wasn't banged in was where I was sitting in the driver's seat. So now that I'm thinking about it now, I'm like, wow, that is the only part of the car that remained intact, the part that I was sitting in. And I just want to um, thank God for being living on this one. Thank God for all the prayers of the saints. Thank God for just staying prayerful. Um, I just... I just want to thank God. Um, I think sometimes you don't realize, sometimes when you're in, other people realize more than you that, man, that was life-threatening. You kind of just walk away and it's still almost shocking. Um, still, when I get in the car, I just keep seeing this scene and it's like, uh -huh. it was so unreal how fast that happened. I just thank God for sparing my life. Oh, yes. Well, Friday afternoon, I just want to thank for all the prayers for the saints and just keep me in your prayers. Amen. Amen. It didn't even deploy because God had a cover. Oh, oh. Thank you, Jesus. He didn't even come out of that because oh. God was the airbag. That's right. That's right. Thank you, Jesus. The other ladies' airbags came out. They oh. didn't even come out. Oh, man. Oh. 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 That's why they just ran into a pole. Oh. Airbag didn't even come out. Oh. God was the airbag. Yeah. Huh? Oh. Yeah. God was the good guy. Yeah. Yeah. Saints. Right. They trying to live right and you're saying, I gotta turn them around. 